Now we steer from today's cars to tomorrow's. Here's Lisa Barrow with all the latest motor news. According to the American Heritage College Dictionary, a coupe is a closed two-door automobile or a dessert served in a special glass. To coupe lovers, tired of the same repetitious variations on a theme, the Audi TT Coupe is both. Although not served up in a special glass, the TT's tautly drawn exterior is served up on a prominent set of 17-inch alloy wheels that perfectly complement the TT's bold circular theme and further cement Audi's reputation as a producer of cutting-edge designs and technology. Technology that's shared throughout the Audi Volkswagen line. Above those eye-catching wheels, the TT rides on a reworked version of the new fourth-generation Golf chassis. Also shared is the TT's 1.8-liter, five-valve, four-cylinder engine. It's the same one that powers the Volkswagen Passat. But the TT edition comes with a larger turbocharger that delivers more boost and pumps up output from 150 to 180 horsepower. Torque is rated at 173 pound-feet. That power spins the front wheels via a smooth five-speed manual transmission. And an all-wheel drive quattro version will also be available. Inside, the visual feast continues with TT cloth and Valcona trimmed leather seats and plenty of bright aluminum accents that spice up the interior. But more than just treats for the eyes, they also serve a functional role, like the dimpled rings around the vents that increase or decrease airflow when rotated to the left or right. Behind the TT logoed aluminum faceplate is an 80 watt AM FM cassette stereo. A 175 watt premium Bose system is also available, as well as a rear mounted six disc CD changer. The TT also boasts 2 plus 2 seating, but the 50-50 split folding rear seats are for children only. But when folded, open up the rear to accommodate 24.2 cubic feet of cargo in the front-wheel drive model, 18.6 in the Quattro. Like all five-star meals, the Audi TT Coupe will arrive in courses. The 1.8-liter front-drive version will be served in the spring of 99 as a 2,000-year model, with the Quattro arriving later in the summer. And a delectable 225-horsepower 6-speed TT will be available sometime in the year 2000. And that's it for this week's Motor News.